Hi guys, I'm back here with a new video and today I'm actually redrawing my characters. I think this old drawing was like from four years ago or two years ago. I forgot the date. It's still kind of newish, kind of not, but it's definitely not like old. <laughs> that, um, really. So, yeah. Okay, so I actually wanted to do this video because I was looking at my computer and all my OC drawings I did and then I have this folder called group pictures where I used to draw my characters in like a group and I never, I never do that anymore. I think it was, I think because it was too time consuming, I stopped or I got lazy. But I want to try and get back into that because even though the art was kind of wonky, I still had fun. And it kind of showed my characters' personalities kind of in the, in the drawings. So I found this drawing and then I was like, I, want, I wonder how it would look in my new style. Because obviously my style has changed, not dramatically, but um, enough. Um... I think, I think the biggest thing is it used to be kind of, well, it is technically still could be considered anime, but like the eyes and, and stuff, I got rid of all that. I just made it like illustration type eyes, like just black dots, I guess, because I got sick of drawing like the whole anime detailed stuff like that. And I already can't really draw like the face symmetrical enough, so... <laughs> I don't know. I like I like how I draw eyes now. And another thing, uh, another difference I notice is the lips. Um, I this is actually very inspired by Kim Possible because you know how with the females, like they have like the over shade on their lips. I guess it kind of looks like a mustache, but it's not. But <laughs> I was very inspired to add that in my drawings, and I like. I like how that looks on my characters, so I stuck with that. And I think the last thing is their character design, because I redrew my character Rain. She is the girl on the right. I redrew her character design, and I liked it. And then I saw Livia, the girl in the middle. I was like, I kind of want to redraw her too. I like her outfit. It's never like the hair or anything. It's the outfit. And I changed it, and I'm like, oh great, now I need to remember, like, make a reference of how this outfit looks now. Because the other one was good, but this one, I feel like it suits her better, especially for the story. I, I don't know, um, I, I, it's, a, it's definitely a big improvement from like the first time I drew her. She was in this green outfit, and... I don't know, it, was, it wasn't bad, but I feel like it didn't really match what I was going for. Like, later on, obviously at first I was like, yay, this is her outfit, let's draw the comic and everything. But now I'm like, no, I gotta fix it to make it, like, I don't, I don't know. So, uh, <laughs> make it fantasy outfit type thing. So, um, yeah, I'm pretty sure though. I mentioned in a video or no okay you know what never mind okay so the video I had a video where I drew rain but I think I scrapped it yeah I'm pretty sure I scrapped it because the audio kept getting cut off and YouTube hated it for some reason so I never uploaded it but any, anyways I mentioned in the video that rain her outfit reminds me of demon slayer for some reason so that's all I wanted to say <laughs> about that so um Okay, so about the drawing, I think I definitely improved. There's obviously some color theory stuff I need to practice. And I was like, I kind of want to know how to pick colors better. Because I feel like I know what I'm doing, but I don't. Like, I have a vision of what the color scheme I want in my head. But when I put it on, put it like on pencil side or on paper, the colors kind of look muddy together. So maybe if I learn color, color theory more, I could be like, oh, this goes with this and all that stuff. So yeah, and also, ow, I just, I just hurt my hand, ow. <laughs> 
I'm just like waving my arms while doing commentary, sorry. Anyways, um, also, I got kind of irritated with Jack. He is the guy on the left. I drew his arms crossed, and I was like, I have to redraw the arm, well, the hand arm, whatever, that looks wonky, because I was like, I was so close to being like, this is done. Like, the flat colors and stuff was already on the characters, and I was, like, done. But then I was like, no, I need to go back and fix it, even if it looks still wonky. It won't look that bad compared to this, because I was just being lazy at that point. And then I fixed it, and it looks slightly better. I even looked up a reference on Pinterest, so that really helped, and he looks slightly better, slightly. And then the next thing was, um, I decided to add the companion, Olivia's companion, which is a cat, and I decided to add her on top of her head. You guys will see that later on. I hope, <laughs> I don't know. I, don't, I really don't know where I'm at in this video. I'm like recording on a different screen, and I can't see like the, where the video is processing or like going on, I guess. So, yeah, I just feel like the drawing looked empty, so I was like, I'll add a cat in this drawing, and I really like her color scheme. I might fix it a little bit more, a little bit, because, like, the black and everything, it's kind of, like, kind of muddy. Again, I need to learn how to do color theory, so, uh, please, please, uh, <laughs> spare me. I know the coloring kind of looks off, and speaking of the coloring... I experimented more on layers because I really like the paint tool side layers, especially luminosity. So, yeah. I really hope you guys like the video. I'm very glad I actually redrew these characters because I don't know, it's just fun to see how my art style has changed. And, uh, uh yeah, I really want to draw other things too, but I feel like as a start, um, this is actually very good because I, I always redraw like simple kind of drawings, never like characters, well, drawings that include like more than one character really. So I guess that's actually very good practice. So, um, uh, yeah, uh, I really don't know what to talk about next. Um, my next video should be another Disney challenge i don't have a title for that it's basically where i draw disney princesses in one color scheme so first i did ariel which is red next is orange i'm pretty sure i'm going to draw merida next and i can't wait for that and i actually kind of miss uploading and i i've been trying to keep a schedule and i want to try and upload every wednesday if i can but i kind of want to do two videos a week but I, I'm trying to like get back into uploading, so I I might just hold on hold off on two videos and just make it one for now, and then when I get back into the groove, I'll upload more and make sure it's actually quality, not perfect, but like quality, like not rushed or anything. So um, uh, yeah. So I really hope you guys like this video. And I'll see you guys next Wednesday for that Disney art challenge video. Bye!